Hey there, this is Siti Nerati from Siti Nerati Studio. In today's video, I want to share with you my current work in progress Fruit Loops, a pastel painting. Here's a bit of how I started with the background for this painting. You can see here that I worked halfway through the painting, including the subjects. I used white pastel first then light blue because I wanted to create a sort of blue cloudy background but I wasn't sure where I wanted to go at that moment. So now that I've completed the painting I'm going to add the details. I started off with the red loop and I have four more to go. Although I initially worked with a photo reference for the refining stage, I find that using a tablet or a computer monitor is much easier, especially since it's so easy to zoom into the subject to see the detail up close. I simply place my painting next to my big monitor and enlarge the photo reference so I can see the subject's detail clearly. You can see that the serial's texture is not smooth. I might want to soften the background just a bit to give the impression that the serial's texture is rough. I already layered a lot of colors, so now I'm focusing on emphasizing the lighter part of the serial with pink pastel. Now I'm using darker red. I'm darkening the dark values on some parts of the loops. Also, I'm darkening those little holes that you can see on the Fruit Loops. If you have this cereal, take one of it, look and observe the exterior texture. So this is what I'm creating right now, the rough texture on the surface. For me, the detailing part takes a while because as you may already know, or not, if this is the first time you're on my channel, I do realistic style paintings. So I spent a bulk of my time working to make my paintings look as real as possible. Doing the detailing requires you to observe your object meticulously to the microscopic level. The detailing part is the most fun part to me because I have to make sure that I examine all the parts of my subject. This is the part of the painting process where I can see my subject come to life. Now I'm changing back to pink pastel. I'm blending a bit on the surface with my pinky. I don't use my pinky a lot except for the final stages of my paintings. What I'm doing here is I'm just tapping the part that I've covered with a new light color because I don't want to make the texture of the cereal very smooth. Right now, I'm using pink pastel just to create the highlights on the surface. I hope you've learned a little bit of my detailing process by watching me do it with this painting, Fruit Loops. Are you interested in being the first to know when one of my new paintings is available for sale? If so, be sure to go to ctnewartistudio.com and subscribe. Stay creative and thanks so much for watching Ctnewarty Studio.